I got this from Ross and it says home. Welcome home. What's up, E Gang? It's your girl Ebony Elbow. Today is August 21st, 2023. It's a very exciting day because we move in our new place. This is a brand new um, luxury townhome. It was just built. I'm the first person to occupy this unit. So, yeah, let's go in. But hold on, y'all. We got our mat. Let's put our mat down for the first time and we're going to go on in. All right, so I just got me a cute little mat. I need to sweep this porch, but yeah. We got our mat down. It's so cute. I got this from Ross and it says home. Welcome home. All right, so this is when you first come in the door. These, I love this one. I hope you all can see. Let me lock the door. So it's a smart home. I just got locked out. So it automatically locks in like a I guess like a minute after it's unlocked, it locks back. So yeah, I gotta remember that because I just got locked out. But so this is when you first come in. These are wood tile floors. This is a Lennar, um townhouse. So every, in Florida, Lennar does these really pretty wood tile floors. I don't know what color they look now, but they are gray. So I don't know how they're appearing on camera. So that's the front door when you walk in. And then just to let you know, this townhouse is a little over 1,700 square feet, three bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms. And it does have a covered patio, which we're going to see in a minute. And it has a little loft. So, yeah. So, when you come in, like I said, that's the door. This is a little storage closet. Um, so, yeah, it's a nice size. Sorry, it's trying to focus. And then, so this is the living space area here. Um, it does have the pre, the, uh, I won't say, yeah, pre-wired. Well, not really pre-wired, but it does have it where you can already hang your TV on the wall so you can hide the cords. So I don't have to pay to get that done. And then this is the living room. It's a really nice size. Um, yeah, it's a, it's a nice size. Y'all, excuse me, cause no one's here with me. So I'm doing this house tour by myself. So bear with me. So yeah, this is it. Um, I know a lot of times it's hard to tell on camera, but this is a nice size. And then off of the living room, off this wall, here's your garage. It is a one car garage. Um, and then yeah, I just have my car parked in there. So yeah, it's a one car garage. And then you have a powder bathroom here. Let me cut the light. Oh, it's automatic. Okay, so it has automatic light. And it just has a little pedestal sink, a mirror, light fixture. So yeah, pretty basic, simple. Yeah, that's that. And then you have it does have a ceiling fan. Um, it's like I said, it's a smart home, so it does have your system here, thermostat system here. And then this is your dining space. It's actually a pretty nice size so I'm, i don't know i'm trying to decide if i want to do like a round table or a like rectangular table i'm not sure but this is the dining space area it's a nice size i may do rectangle just because the way it's shaped and then here is your kitchen love the kitchen love 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 so as you can see it has great cabinets it has a lot of cabinet space so i took my shoes off wearing no shoe home so yeah, we have lots of storage. Everything is brand new, like I said. Um, all the warranties and stuff for the appliances are in here. I need to go through everything in a minute. Um, and then here are my keys. I, have, I put one garage door, door open in the car since I got locked out and then this mailbox keys. But these are the cabinets. I'm planning on switching this out to gold. I wanna do gold hardware. We have the um, mowing faucet. I wanna switch this out with the pull down handle. So I do want to switch this out to gold as well, but it's really nice. And then we have, uh-oh, cut it off. Then we have an undermounted sink, farmhouse sink. It's really big, really deep, so that's nice. Um, We have a five burner cooktop. So that's good, because in my previous house, we only had four. Of course, your um microwave, Frigidaire, all the appliances are Frigidaire. We have the fridge with the um ice maker and water. So yeah, like I say, everything is brand new. 
we love brand new so nice size and then over here is just more cabinet space more storage love this kitchen you have your quartz countertop yeah more cabinet space so lots of storage lots of storage we have some down here for my pots and then i think it oh yeah it wraps around y'all so it wraps around to this door so that's pretty cool so right here is a little island i could probably get three chairs here i don't know um i may just do two if it focus but i probably can get away with three but i know for sure definitely two i do plan on doing like a kind of a bigger chair like a fancier contemporary chair so maybe only three um, two will fit right there but it is a nice size i know definitely for sure two i may try to squeeze three in here and then we have our pantry over here and it's um it's not a walk-in but it is a nice size so it has one two three four five five um shelves is there a light for the pantry let's see it has must be around this corner I don't know. Okay, so I guess the pantry doesn't have a light, but that's okay. We can see what we need to see. So that's the pantry. And then this is one of my favorite parts of the home, guys. So this is the screen patio. Y'all, my house now, we don't have this. This is a little fancy thing, baby. You just let it down. I have the stick when you let it up, let it out. But yeah, I guess it's the new stuff. You just let that thing down. So let's go on the patio. It's really big, it's really nice. This was one of the selling points for me. Let's see, can I get it open? All right, hold on, technical difficulties. So this is the screen patio, y'all. It is huge. It goes all the way down there. It is huge. And it is pre-wired to put a TV up here. So this is really nice, I love this. It is screened in. So yeah, this is really, really nice. I love this. I will be out here. It is huge, y'all. Like, huge. Like, yeah. I wish I... I don't know. I don't even know the measurements. I'm going to try to find it. But it goes all the way down. It's the full length of the house. So, yeah. That was like, yeah, I need that. I plan on doing something really cute out here. Maybe like some um faux grass or something from Ikea. I don't know. Something really, really cute out there let me lock my door put this thing back up so yeah let's head upstairs plush carpet y'all it feels really good when you walk on it so we're gonna go straight up as soon as you come off the stairs there's a storage closet here it is a really nice size again you can't really tell from camera but yeah that's the storage closet and then over here you have a little small loft so they do have a, a area here like with a cable plug where you can put the tv here so we'll probably just mount the tv on the wall and not do like an entertainment unit just to save space and then over here is where you would put like some seating. So I'll get like a small sectional and put here, maybe like the end, like the uh the chase end, like the leg end here because you don't want to block this air vent. And then we have another unit up here. Let me cut this down, y'all, because it's hot, baby. Yeah, we need it on 74. It's hot. So yeah, and then the loft goes all the way down. Uh-oh, focus. So the loft goes all the way down and then I could probably even do something over there. Right off the loft is the laundry room. And it is a side by side, so it's not gonna be stacked. So that's good. Same flooring um, in the laundry room. It's really, really nice. It's a really nice size as well. And it has one can light. And then right over here, you have your, um, kids bathroom and this tile does go all the way up to the ceiling so i do like that um and then you have your sink here of course your quartz countertop your faucet and then 
your cabinets here they have gray cabinets throughout the house and then they have a comfort height um toilet so yeah this is really cute i love this tile this is easier to i love this better than the cheap white inserts it's easier to keep clean so yeah this is your bathroom and then right here is your smallest of all the bedrooms um and then i love that the kids have a ceiling fan in their room in my house now they don't but this is my daughter's room because she's just by herself this is the closet i believe this bedroom hers is a 9 by 13 and the boys is a 10 by 13 so yeah it won't focus but yeah this is her bedroom she does have a good view i'm not going to show y'all the view because it's going to show the townhouses but yeah this is it she wants a queen size bed so we'll probably do like a bed against the wall and a dresser here um and then this is the boys room they have the bigger of the two and then like y'all saw the um i just ordered two beds so i'm gonna do like two beds here or i don't know because their tv thing is here i don't know maybe i'll do the two beds this way i don't know we'll figure it out but this is their room it's a nice size it'll do for both of them and then they have a ceiling fan as well and then they have the same size closet it smells so good in here y'all oh my god so new i love a new smell i also want to point out i love the color on the wall i know i don't know if you guys can tell it's like a um it's like a cream and a lot of builders now they're doing like that um white they're being they do like the white and it's cheap the cheap white flat paint and this paint it, it um it doesn't get so dirty so easily so i like that and then i know lenar doesn't do this anymore they do white but these townhouses were built um they had started building these before they started doing all the budget cuts so now we're gonna go to the master bedroom so this is the master bedroom it is huge it is massive of course you cannot tell from camera but it is really really big um it is big so i guess the tv i guess i'll place like the bed here i'm gonna put my desk. i may put my, put my desk right here in front of the windows i think that'll be cute put my desk here tv there bed two nightstands and i still have room it has a really nice size closet so this is the closet it's big and it has some shelving here and then it goes all the way around it is big, really nice size I love this closet it is a nice size and then i love this this shelving here like i could do a lot here so like my purses and stuff like that so that's really really cute this room is huge y'all huge so yeah and then i have a ceiling fan as well and then so this is the bathroom again you have your um gray cabinets throughout your quartz countertops it does have a double vanity um, you have two mirrors here and then your um lights so it's pretty you know basic stuff um you do have your toilet here and then you have a really nice walk-in shower with the can light so that's cute and then it has like a little small partition here same flooring love this flooring and this is a really nice size shower y'all so i like this this is really cute again you have the ceiling i meant the um tile to the ceiling so that's cute i may switch all this out to gold yeah depending on how long i plan on being here but yeah this is really cute i like it really really nice um comment down below let me know your favorite part of the house like i said um the back patio is one of my favorites and i do like the shower in the master bed no the kitchen the kitchen too i love these gray cabinets it's so modern so sleek so cool so yeah um i'm just really excited about moving in lots of videos coming 
decorating, making this house a home. We're gonna go some furniture shopping. I didn't bring anything with me. I have all new everything. So nothing from my old house, but you know, like pots, pans, stuff like that, and some decor. But as far as furniture, we're starting fresh with everything. So a blank canvas. So yes, yeah, stay tuned as I make this house a home. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for watching, E-Gang.